May 20th, which means this is day 19 on the trail. It's amazing how fast time is flying. Though when you're struggling up these mountains, these steep climbs uh, in the heat, it doesn't seem like it's going very fast. Uh, I learned a tip yesterday. I'll be doing some uh, tip videos. But uh, when you fill your water jug up at the creek, make sure you attach it back to your backpack. Don't wait until you get almost up to the top of the mountain and you find out you forgot your water. And then, being a dunderhead, hike all the way back down with your pack on to pick up your water. Then you realize, i got to hike back up this mountain with my pack on. Or I should have taken it off and just hiked down and back. So that's my tip for the day. You learn as you go. you got to think sometimes. Uh, yeah, yesterday was a struggle. The heat and th this roller coaster section are really steep climbs, lots of rocks. Uh, they don't believe in switchbacks, so I think that's why they call it the roller coaster. It's pretty much straight up and straight down, a few curves here and there. Uh, yeah, it's tough. You really uh, use every bit of strength that you have, and by the end of the day, you are exhausted. Uh, we were supposed to go three more miles to the hostel, and where they had showers and uh, beds and food and drink, but you know what? We just couldn't make it, so we stopped here at Sam Moore Shelter. Sam Moore Shelter is a nice shelter. Not a lot of good camp or attending sites, but we found a, a decent one. Uh, there's probably seven or eight people here last night. Uh, we thought it was going to rain. The thunder chased us in. Uh, so we hurried up and set things up because we thought we were going to get some showers, but they never materialized. So that's a good thing. Uh, what else? I guess that's about it. Uh, today, the high is only supposed to be about 69. It's a beautiful morning. Uh, it's in the 60s right now. It just feels great after all this heat. And hopefully we won't be sweating as much as we did the last couple days. I guess the last three days has been hell. But that's part of the trail. So it's not a, a walk in the woods. It's a, uh, a struggle. It's, I mean, picture yourself in the gym for eight hours a day working your butt off. And that's what this is. But it's worth every second of it, so I have no complaints. So today we don't have any specific goal. There's a campsite, I think about six or seven miles away. It's just a campsite. Uh, I'm not sure if there's water there. Uh, the Blackburn Center, I think, is a little further. That's probably 10 or, tw 10 or 12 miles. But since it's a nice day, we might make it there. They have place... Uh, Nice tent sites and food and stuff. We'll see. Anyway, that's it from the trail. So uh, I guess we'll catch you on down the trail. So this is the Sam Moore shelter. That's a nice shelter. Uh, only one person stayed in it last night, which was surprising. Everybody else had tents. Uh, it has a nice big platform. It even has windows up there. It's like being in a lodge, right? Pretty nice. Down there you have the the cooking pavilion. Some of these sites do have pavilions like this where you're with a picnic table. Uh, you can cook and eat your meals down there away from the shelter. Keep the bears away. Uh, this one has a, uh, a makeshift fire pit made out of rocks. That's nice. There's a stream in the background. We've been in by streams the last couple nights, which is nice, falling asleep to the sound of the stream. Then up this way is where we set our tent up last night. And there's the bear pole over there. Those bear poles are nice to hang your bags every night. You don't have to find a tree with a limb in it and throw a rope over it and try to tie them up. So, yeah, this is a really nice sight. And then the privy, as usual, is way up on the hill. You can't see it, but it's a nice little walk up the mountain to uh, do your business in the morning. So this is the Sam Moore Shelter. Uh, 
still haven't stayed in a shelter yet. I'm sure we will before this trip is over with. That's it for now. I'll catch you down the trail. That must be one, two, three, maybe four feet long. There's our morning snake. It's got to be at least four feet long, probably longer. Big old black snake.